Good morning. Welcome to our morning devotion. Glad you are tuned to the morning encounter. It is our prayer that you will encounter with God through this broadcast. And now, let's welcome the servant of God. The Lord bless you, dear friends. We bless the Lord again for another day. Indeed, the Lord is good. This morning, I want to share a reflection with you from a statement that somebody made. It was a regretful statement. He said, they won't let me in. They won't let me in. And so I, allow me to share a thought. And maybe you're asking, what was that? What was that that made that man make? that kind of regret. It was a story about a woman who was trapped on the top floor of a burning building. And the flames and smoke blocked the way of escape. And the firefighters were called and they arrived in time. And one man went up. He scrambled through the ladder and went up to the window where the woman was screaming from. And on arriving there, he stretched his, his, his arm to offer help to the woman who was inside, inside the burning house, up on top of, 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 uh, of the building. And when that woman came, she peeped out through the window and saw the great distance between where she was and way down, way down where she was supposed to be rescued you know, rescued and taken. And so, out of panic, she drew back. She drew back. She feared falling. And so she drew back. And the man, attempting to rescue her, begged her even more and said, you can trust my hand. You can trust me. But the lady retreated further and further. The fire was threatening. The fire was threatening the life of the rescuer. The fire was threatening and so the man decided to return back and he went down and down there the man lamented and said she couldn't let me she won't let me she won't let me rescue her and so my dear friend allow me to read a thought in the book of Matthew chapter 11 verses 28 the word of God says come to me Come to me, all who labor and are heavy laden, and I will give you rest. Come to me, all who are heavy laden and those who are laboring, and I will give you rest. My dear friend, the Lord Jesus Christ is calling. The Lord Jesus Christ is calling and inviting us into his eternal rest. We wake up daily, we wake up daily to news that are exerting pressure on us. Every day when we wake up, we are told that the, the, the fuel price has gone up. We wake up every day and we are told that the, flour, the, the price of, of, of maize flour has gone up. We are told every day that the transport to one destination to an one destination from one, uh, the transport from one destination to another has gone up, has increased. And so every day life is exerting pressure on us. Every day, every day. And Jesus is calling us, come, come. He's inviting us to enter rest. I want to suggest to you this morning, my dear friend, that it's possible to have rest in the world full of turmoil, in the world full of, of, of pressure. It is possible to get rest in the Lord Jesus Christ. It is possible to be peaceful in a turbulent world. It is possible to be to, 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 to enjoy the rest of Jesus in the world that is full of confusion and pressure. And, so, and, and, and therefore, this morning, my, 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 my dear friend, the word of God is telling us, cast your burden, cast your burden upon the Lord. Cast your burden upon the Lord. Perhaps you're there, you're, you've woken up, you're just wondering, looking at the day with uncertainty. You don't know what is coming up. You don't know what the, 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 the day is going to offer. The Lord just says, say, cast your burden upon me. Cast those cares upon me, for I care. Cast them upon me. Those are the words of Jesus Christ. He said, bring them to me. Cast your heavy laden 
upon me and I will give you rest. This day, my friend, I want to suggest to you, as you're starting the day, call on the Lord Jesus Christ. Trust that he can give you rest. Trust that he can guide the process to, uh, for you. Trust that he can come through for you today and you will be you will enjoy the rest of Jesus. You will enjoy the peace of Jesus. When you hear the news about uh, 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 prices of commodities going up through the ceiling, you can say, I rest my case on the Lord Jesus Christ. The Lord Jesus Christ is with me and he can give you, he will give you rest. He will give you rest. Allow me to pray with you even as I bring this to a close and even as I allow you to walk by faith, to move by faith into a victorious day. The Lord Jesus Christ will bless you. You've called upon us this morning that we have an opportunity to come to you and receive rest. And therefore, Lord, this morning, with my dear friends, with my dear brothers and sisters, we are coming to you. We are coming to you asking, oh Lord, would you hold our hands? Would you guide us through? Would you be our master again? Would you be our, 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 our Lord again, guiding us through the day? The world has, 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 has casted, the world has brought many cares, many things, Lord, that, 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 are, that are, are threatening, things that are, are uncertain, oh Lord, but in you we can get rest. You've assured us, Lord, that when we cast our burdens upon you, we will, we will have rest. We, when we cast our burdens upon you, you care and you will give us rest. And therefore, Lord, this day, as we start, the, uh, as we start our day, we are coming to you just the way we are with our cares we are coming to you would you lift them uh, off our shoulders would you give us rest we give you praise we give you glory in jesus name the lord bless you my dear friend again may the lord guide you may he lift the heavy weights the heavy burdens the the, the labor may he give you rest as you move into the day the lord will bless you the lord will be you will see the favor of the Lord, the goodness of the Lord. My name is Philip Odera. It was really a great pleasure to start the day with you. I'm praying that would you see the grace of the Lord. Be blessed. We'll meet again. That was the morning encounter. We are glad that you tuned in. Follow us on YouTube at Sidim Eldora TV. Our Facebook page is Sidham Eldoran. Our Twitter and Instagram handles at Sidham Eldoran. And our website is eldorat.sidham.org. Let's encounter again tomorrow morning, same time, same place.